Living Your Blessed Life Prologue In the vast tapestry of human existence, there is a common thread that binds us all, a yearning for a life filled with purpose, joy, and a deep sense of fulfillment. It is a pursuit as old as time itself, an unspoken quest that transcends culture, age, and circumstance. It is the timeless journey towards a blessed life. This book invites you to embark on a transformative odyssey, guided by the principles of gratitude, mindfulness, and the pursuit of passions. It is a journey that transcends mere existence, for it is about discovering the profound significance that beckons each one of us. In the following chapters, we will explore the multifaceted dimensions of living a blessed life, a life characterized by appreciating what you have, finding joy in the present, and aligning your actions with your deepest values and aspirations. We will delve into the core elements of this journey, from understanding the power of gratitude to navigating life's challenges with resilience and grace. Along this path, you will discover the connection between inner happiness and a blessed life, explore the art of mindfulness and positive thinking, and learn to let go of negative patterns that may be holding you back. You will uncover the significance of nurturing relationships, spreading love and kindness, and embracing abundance in all its forms. As you turn the pages of this book, you will find practical guidance, heartfelt stories, and actionable steps that will empower you to create your own blessed life. It is a journey that requires dedication, self-reflection, and a commitment to change, but the rewards are immeasurable. So, dear reader, let us begin this transformative exploration together. Whether you are at the crossroads of change or seeking to deepen your connection to a life filled with blessings, this book offers a roadmap to guide you on your path. May you find inspiration within these pages and may your journey towards a blessed life be a testament to the beauty of transformation and the limitless potential that resides within you. Chapter 1 Introduction to the Blessed Life A blessed life is like discovering hidden treasure in the ordinary moments where joy and gratitude dance hand in hand. It's about waking up each day with a heart full of appreciation for the simple blessings that surround us. This life is a symphony of laughter, love, and contentment where even challenges become stepping stones to growth and fulfillment. With a blessed life, you're not just existing, you're thriving in the art of cherishing what you have and finding bliss in every breath. Gratitude, often underestimated, holds within it the power to transform our lives in ways we could never imagine. It is the silent force that can reshape our perspective, our relationships, and even our destinies. At its essence, gratitude is a profound recognition of the blessings we have, no matter how big or small they may seem. It's about acknowledging the beauty in the ordinary, the warmth in a smile, and the abundance in our lives. Gratitude is not merely a fleeting emotion but a way of life, a lens through which we view the world. When we embrace the power of gratitude, we unlock a multitude of benefits. It can heal wounds, bridge divides, and mend broken spirits. It has the capacity to dissolve negativity, replacing it with a sense of contentment and inner peace. Gratitude reminds us that even in the face of adversity, there is always something to be thankful for. In this book, we will delve deep into the art of gratitude, exploring its psychological and emotional benefits. We will uncover practical ways to incorporate gratitude into our daily routines, transforming it from a fleeting feeling to a lifelong habit. By the end of this journey, you will understand the profound impact that gratitude can have on your life, and you'll be equipped with the tools to harness its incredible power for your own well-being and the betterment of those around you. Life can be an intricate and challenging journey, filled with twists and turns that sometimes leave us feeling lost or overwhelmed. It's a path where obstacles can seem insurmountable and the weight of responsibilities can bear down heavily upon our shoulders. But amid these trials and tribulations, there exists a beacon of hope, a path to a blessed life. Throughout the pages of this book, you will embark on a transformational voyage. It's a voyage that acknowledges life's difficulties and embraces them as opportunities for growth. You will discover that even in the darkest moments, there are glimmers of light waiting to illuminate your path. This book is your guide to not just surviving but thriving. It's a roadmap to finding joy, contentment, and appreciation, even when life's storms rage. You'll learn to navigate the labyrinth of challenges with grace and resilience, emerging stronger and wiser on the other side. Join us on this incredible journey of self-discovery and transformation. Let's unlock the secrets to living a blessed life, where every day is a gift, every experience is a lesson, and every moment is an opportunity to find joy in the midst of life's complexities. Chapter 2 Cultivating Gratitude Understanding the Science of Gratitude Gratitude, often viewed as a simple expression of thanks, holds a profound scientific significance that extends far beyond mere politeness. 
Researchers from various fields, including psychology and neuroscience, have delved into the depths of gratitude, unraveling its intricate connections to our well-being, mental health, and even our brain chemistry. At its core, gratitude is more than a fleeting emotion, it's a cognitive and emotional state. It involves recognizing and appreciating the positive aspects of life, from the tangible gifts we receive to the intangible moments of connection and kindness. Understanding the science behind gratitude can shed light on its transformative power in our lives. Neuroscientists have made remarkable discoveries about the brain's response to gratitude. When we experience gratitude, our brain releases a surge of neurotransmitters, including dopamine and serotonin, often referred to as the brain's feel-good chemicals. These substances play a crucial role in regulating our mood, enhancing our sense of happiness, and reducing stress and anxiety. In essence, practicing gratitude can rewire our brain to become more inclined towards positivity and emotional resilience. Furthermore, gratitude exercises have been shown to stimulate the prefrontal cortex, the region responsible for decision-making, reasoning, and complex thinking. This suggests that cultivating gratitude can sharpen our cognitive abilities and improve our problem-solving skills. Psychologists have also explored the psychological benefits of gratitude. Studies have consistently linked gratitude to increased life satisfaction and overall well-being. People who regularly practice gratitude report lower levels of depression and anxiety, enhanced self-esteem, and stronger interpersonal relationships. It's no surprise that gratitude is often referred to as a natural antidepressant. Moreover, gratitude is not limited to benefiting the individual. When we express gratitude towards others, it fosters a sense of social connectedness and strengthens relationships. Acts of gratitude can create a positive feedback loop, encouraging more acts of kindness and generosity within communities. Understanding the science of gratitude empowers us to harness its potential intentionally. By incorporating gratitude practices into our daily lives, such as keeping gratitude journals, expressing appreciation to others, or simply taking moments to savor life's joys, we can tap into the scientifically proven benefits of gratitude. These practices not only elevate our personal well-being but also contribute to the collective positivity of our communities. In essence, gratitude is not merely a polite gesture but a profound force that has the capacity to transform our brains, enhance our emotional well-being, and enrich our relationships. It reminds us that in every moment, there is an opportunity to find something to be thankful for, and in doing so, we unlock the extraordinary potential of living a life filled with joy and contentment. Gratitude is a potent force that can enhance our well-being and bring a positive shift to our lives. To experience its transformative power, it's essential to make gratitude a daily practice, a habit that becomes an integral part of our daily routine. Here's a guide on how to cultivate daily practices for gratitude. Morning Gratitude Ritual Begin your day with a grateful heart. As you wake up, take a moment to reflect on three things you are thankful for. These can be as simple as the warmth of your bed, the chirping of birds outside your window, or the love of your family. This ritual sets a positive tone for the day ahead. Gratitude Journal Keep a dedicated gratitude journal. Each evening jot down three to five things you're grateful for from your day. Be specific and detailed. Instead of writing I'm grateful for my family, say something like, I'm grateful for the laughter we shared during dinner tonight. Writing it down reinforces your feelings of gratitude. Express gratitude to others, don't keep your gratitude to yourself. Take the time to express appreciation to the people in your life. Send a heartfelt thank you note, make a call, or simply tell someone in person how much you appreciate them. This not only uplifts their spirits but strengthens your connections. Mindful moments, throughout the day, pause for mindful moments. When you enjoy a delicious meal, savor each bite and express gratitude for the nourishment it provides. When you take a walk, appreciate the beauty of nature around you. Mindfulness amplifies your awareness of the present and the blessings within it. Evening Reflection Before bedtime, engage in a brief reflection on your day. Consider the challenges you faced and how you overcame them. Express gratitude for the lessons learned and the growth achieved. Acknowledge the positive moments that brought you joy. Random Acts of Kindness Infuse your daily life with acts of kindness. Hold the door for someone, help a neighbor, or make a small donation to a charity. Acts of kindness not only make others feel appreciated but also foster your sense of gratitude for the ability to make a positive impact. Visual reminders. Place visual reminders of gratitude around your home or workspace. Post inspiring quotes, photos, or artwork that evoke feelings of thankfulness. These reminders can prompt moments of gratitude throughout the day. 
Gratitude Meditation Dedicate a few minutes to gratitude meditation. Sit in a quiet space, close your eyes, and focus on your breath. As you inhale and exhale, think about the things you're grateful for. Let the sensations of gratitude fill your heart and mind. Share gratitude with loved ones, create a gratitude ritual with your family or friends. Share your daily moments of gratitude with each other. This practice fosters a sense of community and reinforces the habit of thankfulness. By incorporating these daily practices for gratitude into your life, you'll cultivate a genuine and lasting appreciation for the blessings that surround you. Over time, you'll find that gratitude becomes second nature, enriching your life with positivity, resilience, and a deeper sense of fulfillment. Remember, gratitude is not just an emotion, it's a way of life and it's within your reach every day. Overcoming Common Gratitude Challenges, Navigating the Path to Thankfulness While the practice of gratitude can be immensely rewarding, it's not always smooth sailing. Many people encounter common challenges along the way that can hinder their journey toward cultivating gratitude. Fortunately, these challenges can be navigated with awareness and intention. Here's a guide on how to overcome some of the most common gratitude obstacles. Taking blessings for granted, it's easy to become accustomed to the blessings in our lives, causing us to overlook them. To overcome this challenge, practice mindfulness. Take a moment to truly appreciate the small things, a warm cup of coffee, a kind gesture, or a beautiful sunset. Regularly remind yourself that nothing is too insignificant to be grateful for. Comparison and envy, comparing our lives to others can lead to feelings of envy and ingratitude. To combat this challenge, shift your focus inward. Reflect on your own journey, acknowledging your unique blessings and achievements. Remember that everyone's path is different, and what matters most is your personal growth and contentment. Expecting too much, some people expect grand gestures or extraordinary events to spark gratitude. To counter this challenge, recalibrate your expectations. Gratitude thrives in the ordinary moments of life. Embrace the beauty in everyday experiences and simple gestures of kindness. Negative circumstances, during difficult times, finding gratitude can seem daunting. To address this challenge, practice reframing. Instead of dwelling on the negative aspects of a situation, seek out the silver linings or lessons within it. Embrace the growth opportunities that adversity presents. Inconsistent practice, gratitude is a habit that requires consistent effort. The challenge here is maintaining the practice over time. Establish a routine for gratitude exercises, whether it's keeping a daily journal, setting reminders, or incorporating gratitude into existing habits like meals or bedtime. Feeling inauthentic, some individuals struggle with feeling inauthentic when expressing gratitude. To overcome this challenge, be genuine in your expressions. Focus on the emotions behind your words, rather than trying to impress or please others. Authenticity and gratitude fosters deeper connections with both yourself and those you appreciate. Lack of time, busy schedules can hinder the practice of gratitude. To address this challenge, integrate gratitude into your daily life in small ways. Offer a quick thank you to someone who helps you, or take a moment to appreciate nature during a short walk. Gratitude can be practiced in mere seconds. Overcoming gratitude fatigue, after a while, some individuals may feel that the practice of gratitude becomes repetitive or loses its impact. To combat this challenge, vary your gratitude expressions. Focus on different aspects of your life, explore new methods, or express gratitude to different people. Variety keeps the practice fresh and engaging. Solo journey, gratitude doesn't have to be a solitary endeavor. Some people struggle to share their gratitude journey with others. To overcome this challenge, consider forming or joining a gratitude group or community. Sharing experiences and insights can provide support and inspiration. By recognizing these common gratitude challenges and taking proactive steps to address them, you can continue to cultivate a genuine and enduring sense of thankfulness in your life. Gratitude is a journey, and like any journey, it may have its ups and downs, but with perseverance and self-awareness, you can navigate these challenges and reap the countless benefits of a grateful heart. Chapter 3. Discovering Inner Happiness The Connection Between Happiness and a Blessed Life in the pursuit of a blessed life, one of the most profound and essential stops along the way is the exploration of inner happiness. At first glance, happiness may seem like a fleeting emotion, an ephemeral state of being that comes and goes like the shifting tides. However, as we delve deeper into the heart of this chapter, we will uncover the intricate connection between happiness and the blessed life we all yearn for. Imagine, for a moment, that your life is a grand tapestry, woven together with threads of experiences, relationships, and emotions. 
Happiness is one of the most vibrant and radiant threads in this tapestry, illuminating the entire composition. It's not just an occasional burst of joy but a continuous undercurrent that colors every aspect of your existence. So, what is the relationship between happiness and a blessed life? Simply put, happiness is not just a consequence of a blessed life, it is an essential ingredient for its creation. In fact, happiness is both the compass that guides us toward a blessed life and the destination itself. To understand this profound connection, we must first recognize that a blessed life is not solely dependent on external circumstances. While external factors such as financial stability, meaningful relationships, and good health undoubtedly contribute to our well-being, they are not the sole determinants of our happiness. If they were, the pursuit of a blessed life would be contingent upon acquiring an endless array of external conditions, a journey with no end. Instead, the blessed life we seek begins with an internal shift, a shift in our perception, our mindset, and our relationship with ourselves. It is here that happiness plays a pivotal role. When we learn to cultivate happiness from within, we gain the ability to appreciate the present moment, regardless of external circumstances. We find joy in the simplest of experiences, and our hearts overflow with gratitude for the blessings that surround us. In this chapter, we will embark on a journey of self-discovery, exploring the multifaceted nature of happiness and its profound impact on our lives. We will delve into the science of happiness, uncovering the psychological and physiological aspects that underpin our well-being. We will also explore practical techniques and strategies to nurture inner happiness, allowing it to flourish and become a guiding light on our path to a blessed life. As we navigate the intricacies of this connection between happiness and a blessed life, remember that the pursuit of inner happiness is not a selfish endeavor. It is, in fact, a noble and selfless pursuit. When we fill our own hearts with happiness, we have more to give to others. Our relationships flourish, our compassion deepens, and our capacity to make a positive impact on the world expands. Mindfulness and positive thinking, illuminating the path to inner happiness. In our fast-paced and often chaotic world, the practices of mindfulness and positive thinking stand as beacons of serenity and optimism. These two powerful tools have the potential to not only transform our mindset but also enhance our overall well-being, ultimately leading us on the path to inner happiness. Mindfulness, at its essence, is the art of being fully present in the moment. It involves deliberately directing our attention to the here and now, without judgment or distraction. In a world teeming with distractions, the practice of mindfulness offers a sanctuary of stillness where we can anchor ourselves in the present moment. When we engage in mindfulness, we become acutely aware of our thoughts, emotions, and bodily sensations. It allows us to observe them with an open heart and non-judgmental awareness. By doing so, we gain clarity about our inner landscape, untangling the web of thoughts and worries that often occupy our minds. The beauty of mindfulness lies in its capacity to foster a deep sense of inner calm and acceptance. It teaches us to embrace each moment, regardless of its nature, as a unique gift. Through mindfulness, we can find joy even in the simplest of experiences, such as sipping a cup of tea, feeling the warmth of the sun on our skin, or savoring a delicious meal. Positive thinking, on the other hand, is a mindset that focuses on the optimistic and hopeful aspects of life. It's not about denying the existence of challenges or difficulties but rather about choosing to view them as opportunities for growth and learning. Positive thinking is a conscious decision to reframe our perspective and seek the silver linings in any situation. The power of positive thinking lies in its ability to shift our emotional state and influence our actions. When we approach life with a positive mindset, we are more resilient in the face of adversity, more creative in problem-solving, and more open to the possibilities that lie ahead. This optimistic outlook can have a profound impact on our overall happiness and life satisfaction. When mindfulness and positive thinking come together, they create a harmonious synergy that can lead us toward inner happiness. Mindfulness allows us to observe our thoughts and emotions without judgment, helping us recognize when negativity creeps in. Positive thinking, in turn, helps us reframe those negative thoughts into more constructive and hopeful ones. Incorporating mindfulness and positive thinking into our daily lives can be a transformative journey. It begins with small, deliberate steps, moments of mindfulness throughout the day, cultivating gratitude, and consciously choosing positive thoughts. Over time, these practices become ingrained in our mindset, guiding us toward a more joyful and fulfilling life. As you embark on this exploration of mindfulness and positive thinking, remember that it is a journey, not a destination. Be patient with yourself and allow these practices to unfold gradually.
With dedication and an open heart, you can illuminate the path to inner happiness, finding joy and contentment in the present moment and nurturing a positive outlook on life's journey. Letting go of negative patterns. Liberating your path to inner happiness. Life often unfolds as a series of patterns and habits that shape our experiences and emotions. While some of these patterns serve us well, others can trap us in a cycle of negativity and unhappiness. In the pursuit of inner happiness, it is essential to recognize and release these negative patterns, freeing ourselves from their grip and reclaiming our joy. Negative patterns can manifest in various forms self-doubt, procrastination, perfectionism, negative self-talk, or even clinging to past regrets and resentments. These patterns often act as invisible barriers, preventing us from fully experiencing the present moment and hindering our journey toward a blessed life. The process of letting go of negative patterns begins with self-awareness. It requires a willingness to examine our thoughts, emotions, and behaviors with a critical yet compassionate eye. Here are key steps to help you navigate this transformative journey. 1. Identify the patterns. Start by recognizing the negative patterns that have been recurring in your life. Pay attention to moments when you feel stuck, anxious, or unhappy. What thoughts or behaviors tend to accompany these feelings? Identifying the patterns is the first step toward breaking free from them. 2. Understand the origin. Dive deeper into the roots of these negative patterns. Often, they are formed as coping mechanisms in response to past experiences or societal pressures. Understanding their origins can provide insight into why they continue to influence your life. 3. Challenge negative self-talk. Negative self-talk is a common and damaging pattern. It involves the inner dialogue where we criticize ourselves, doubt our abilities, or engage in self-sabotaging thoughts. Challenge these negative beliefs with self-compassion and evidence to the contrary. 4. Replace with positive alternatives. Once you've identified a negative pattern, work on replacing it with a more positive and constructive alternative. For example, if you tend to procrastinate due to self-doubt, replace it with a belief in your capabilities and a focus on small, achievable steps. 5. Practice mindfulness. Mindfulness plays a significant role in breaking negative patterns. By being present in the moment, you can observe your thoughts and emotions as they arise. This awareness empowers you to choose how you respond, rather than reacting impulsively. 6. Seek support. Breaking free from entrenched negative patterns can be challenging. Don't hesitate to seek support from a therapist, counselor, or a trusted friend. They can offer guidance, insights, and encouragement as you work toward transformation. 7. Cultivate patience and persistence. Letting go of negative patterns is a gradual process that requires patience and persistence. It's normal to experience setbacks along the way, but don't be discouraged. Each step toward change, no matter how small, is a step closer to inner happiness. 8. Celebrate progress. Celebrate your victories, no matter how minor they may seem. Recognize and acknowledge the positive changes you make in your life. This reinforcement can motivate you to continue on your path of personal growth. Letting go of negative patterns is a profound act of self-compassion and self-liberation. It allows you to release the chains that bind you to unhappiness and opens the door to a life filled with joy, contentment, and a greater sense of fulfillment. As you navigate this transformative journey, remember that you have the power to shape your own narrative and create the positive patterns that lead to inner happiness. In the journey of discovering inner happiness and unraveling the profound connection between happiness and a blessed life, we have embarked on a transformative exploration of the human spirit. Through the lenses of mindfulness, positive thinking, and the release of negative patterns, we have delved deep into the realms of personal growth and fulfillment. Our expedition began with the understanding that happiness is not a fleeting emotion but a continuous undercurrent that colors every facet of our existence. It is both the compass that guides us toward a blessed life and the destination itself. As we cultivated mindfulness, we learned to be fully present in each moment, to savor life's simple pleasures, and to observe our thoughts and emotions with acceptance and non-judgmental awareness. The synergy of mindfulness and positive thinking illuminated the path to inner happiness. Mindfulness allowed us to recognize when negativity crept into our lives and empowered us to reframe our thoughts. Positive thinking, in turn, helped us view life's challenges as opportunities for growth and learning. This harmonious blend of practices shifted our emotional state, fostering resilience, creativity, and a more optimistic outlook on life. In the process of nurturing inner happiness, we also confronted the necessity of letting go of negative patterns. These patterns, often deeply ingrained and rooted in past experiences, can hinder our progress toward a blessed life. 
Through self-awareness and self-compassion, we identified these patterns, understood their origins, and embarked on a journey of transformation. We replaced self-doubt with self-belief, procrastination with proactive action, and self-criticism with self-kindness. As we conclude this exploration, it's essential to acknowledge that the pursuit of inner happiness is not a one-time endeavor but a lifelong commitment. It is a journey of self-discovery, resilience, and personal growth. It is a journey filled with moments of clarity and moments of challenge. However, it is a journey that holds the promise of a more fulfilling and blessed life. In the union of mindfulness, positive thinking, and the release of negative patterns, we find the keys to unlock the gates of inner happiness. These keys are not elusive, they are within our reach, waiting to be embraced and integrated into our daily lives. They empower us to live each day with gratitude, optimism, and a deep sense of contentment. As you move forward on your own path toward inner happiness and a blessed life, remember that you hold the power to shape your reality. The journey may be filled with twists and turns, but with mindfulness as your guide, positive thinking as your compass, and the courage to release negative patterns, you can embark on a life illuminated by the radiant light of inner happiness. Your blessed life is waiting to be discovered, one mindful moment, one positive thought, and one released pattern at a time. Chapter 4 Nurturing Relationships Nurturing relationships is akin to tending to a garden. Just as a garden requires care, attention, and nourishment to bloom with vibrant colors and fragrant blossoms, our relationships thrive when we invest in them with love, empathy, and genuine connection. In this chapter, we embark on a heartfelt journey into the world of relationships, exploring the profound impact they have on our lives and the reciprocity of joy and support that flourishes when we tend to them. Our relationships are like mirrors, reflecting back to us the myriad facets of our own humanity. They can be a source of immense joy, providing companionship, laughter, and a shoulder to lean on during life's trials. At the same time, they can also be a mirror to our own growth, revealing areas where we can learn, evolve, and deepen our understanding of ourselves and others. This chapter is an exploration of the art of nurturing relationships, encompassing both the bonds of family and the treasured friendships we cultivate along the way. We will delve into the fundamental principles of fostering meaningful connections, the importance of open communication, and the significance of empathy and understanding. Additionally, we will uncover the role of gratitude in relationships, a force that not only strengthens the bonds we share but also enhances our own sense of well-being. Gratitude has the power to transform ordinary interactions into moments of profound connection, reminding us of the beauty in acknowledging the love and support we receive from those we cherish. As we journey through this chapter, let us embark on a path of self-discovery within the context of our relationships. Let us learn to nurture these connections as if they were the most precious blossoms in our garden of life, for in doing so, we nurture the very essence of our own blessed existence. Building Positive Connections, The Heartbeat of a Blessed Life At the core of a blessed life lies the tapestry of relationships, woven with threads of connection, trust, and love. Our interactions with family, friends, and the people we encounter on life's journey are not incidental, they are the vibrant colors that make our existence rich and meaningful. Building and nurturing positive connections is an art that infuses our lives with joy, support, and a deep sense of belonging. Positive connections are the lifeblood of our well-being, providing us with a sense of purpose and fulfillment. They are the bonds that empower us to weather life's storms, celebrate its victories, and cherish its everyday moments. In essence, they are the cornerstone of a blessed life. So, how do we go about building positive connections that enrich our lives and the lives of those we touch? It begins with intention and the cultivation of certain qualities that form the foundation of meaningful relationships. 1. Authenticity Authenticity is the bedrock of positive connections. It involves being true to yourself and allowing others to see your genuine self. When you approach relationships with authenticity, you create a space where trust can thrive and deep connections can flourish. 2. Empathy Empathy is the ability to understand and share the feelings of another. It involves stepping into someone else's shoes and offering a listening ear, a compassionate heart, and a willingness to support and uplift. Empathy fosters a sense of understanding and mutual care, paving the way for positive connections. 3. Active listening Building positive connections requires more than just talking, it requires active listening. When we truly listen to others, we show that we value their thoughts and feelings. This simple act can transform ordinary interactions into moments of profound connection. 4. Gratitude. Expressing gratitude within relationships is like watering a plant, it nourishes and sustains them. It involves recognizing and appreciating the love, support, and kindness we receive from others. 
Gratitude creates a positive cycle of giving and receiving, strengthening the bonds of connection. 5. Open communication. Effective communication is the bridge that connects hearts and minds. Being open, honest, and transparent in our conversations allows for the free flow of thoughts and emotions, resolving misunderstandings and deepening connections. 6. Vulnerability. Vulnerability is the courage to show our true selves, including our fears and insecurities. When we allow ourselves to be vulnerable with others, we invite them to do the same. This authenticity strengthens the ties that bind us. 7. Mutual respect. Respect is the cornerstone of any healthy relationship. It involves valuing each other's boundaries, opinions, and individuality. Mutual respect creates an environment where positive connections can thrive. 8. Acts of kindness. Small acts of kindness can have a big impact on relationships. Whether it's a heartfelt compliment, a supportive gesture, or simply being there in times of need, acts of kindness nurture positive connections. As we embark on the journey of building positive connections, let us remember that the effort we invest in our relationships is a reflection of the love and care we bring into the world. These connections are not only a source of happiness and support in our lives but also a gift that we can offer to others. In the tapestry of our existence, they are the most precious threads, weaving together a blessed life filled with meaning and joy. Building Healthy Family Relationships Our family, whether biological or chosen, is often the first and most enduring social unit we encounter in life. Nurturing healthy family relationships is essential to fostering a sense of belonging and security that reverberates throughout our journey. 1. Communication Open and honest communication is the cornerstone of healthy family relationships. It involves not only sharing daily experiences but also discussing feelings, hopes, and concerns. Effective communication strengthens connections and resolves misunderstandings. 2. Boundaries Setting and respecting boundaries within the family is crucial. Boundaries create a sense of autonomy while ensuring mutual respect and consideration. Establishing healthy boundaries promotes harmony and reduces conflict. 3. Quality time Spending quality time together is a powerful way to nurture family bonds. Whether it's shared meals, game nights, or outdoor adventures, these moments create lasting memories and strengthen the emotional connection within the family. 4. Empathy Practicing empathy within the family fosters understanding and compassion. It involves recognizing and validating each other's feelings and perspectives, even when they differ from our own. Empathy deepens emotional bonds. 5. Conflict Resolution Conflicts are inevitable in any relationship, including family. Learning constructive conflict resolution skills is essential. It involves active listening, compromise, and finding solutions that prioritize the well-being of all family members. Family and Friendships, the Essence of a Blessed Life In the intricate mosaic of our lives, two of the most profound and enduring elements are our relationships with family and friends. These connections are the bedrock of our emotional well-being and they hold the power to shape the very essence of a blessed life. In this section, we delve into the art of building healthy relationships with our loved ones, exploring the profound impact they have on our overall happiness and fulfillment. Family, the roots of love. Our relationships with family are often the earliest and most enduring connections we form in life. These ties forged through blood, shared experiences, and unwavering support run deep, providing us with a sense of belonging and security. Nurturing these familial bonds is essential in our pursuit of a blessed life. Building healthy relationships within our families requires a foundation of love, respect, and communication. It involves acknowledging the unique strengths and weaknesses of each family member and celebrating the diversity that enriches our collective experiences. It is in the moments of shared laughter, in the comfort of shared sorrows, and in the unconditional love that we find the true essence of family. Open and empathetic communication is key to maintaining harmonious family relationships. Listening with an open heart, expressing feelings honestly, and offering support during challenging times are essential components of building healthy connections with our relatives. Family relationships flourish when we approach them with patience, understanding, and a commitment to resolving conflicts with love and compassion. Friendships, the gems of our journey. Friendships, like precious gems, adorn the tapestry of our lives with brilliance and diversity. These connections are not bound by blood but are instead forged through shared interests, experiences, and the joy of companionship. Healthy friendships are an integral part of a blessed life, providing us with a network of emotional support, laughter, and shared adventures. To cultivate and maintain meaningful friendships, we must invest time and effort in nurturing these connections. 
It involves being a loyal and trustworthy friend, offering a listening ear during times of need, and celebrating each other's successes. Healthy friendships thrive when we reciprocate the love and care we receive, creating a mutual exchange of support and joy. Communication is the lifeblood of friendships. It is through heartfelt conversations, shared experiences, and the ability to confide in one another that friendships deepen and grow. Being present and attentive when our friends need us, whether for celebration or solace, strengthens the bonds of connection. In both family and friendships, gratitude plays a significant role in nurturing healthy relationships. Expressing gratitude for the love, support, and companionship we receive reminds us of the blessings that these connections bring into our lives. Gratitude fosters a sense of appreciation and deepens our bonds with those we hold dear. As we navigate the intricate landscape of family and friendships, let us remember that these connections are not static but dynamic, evolving over time. They require continuous care, love, and understanding. By building healthy relationships with our loved ones, we enhance our sense of belonging, support, and joy, ultimately enriching our journey toward a truly blessed life. Spreading love and kindness, the path to receiving the best blessings. In a world often marked by its frenetic pace and the challenges we face daily, spreading love and kindness emerges as a powerful antidote. These simple yet profound acts have the unique ability to not only positively impact others but also usher in a torrent of blessings into our own lives. As we embark on the journey of spreading love and kindness, let us explore how this endeavor can lead us to receive the best blessings life has to offer. 1. Cultivating Compassion Spreading love and kindness begins with empathic compassion, a willingness to understand and share the feelings of others. By empathizing with the struggles and joys of those around us, we connect on a deeper level, forging bonds of genuine compassion. This empathetic approach to life opens our hearts to the experiences of others, making us more attuned to their needs and desires. 2. Acts of Kindness as a Daily Practice Small acts of kindness, often unnoticed by the world, have the potential to create ripples of positivity. Whether it's offering a kind word, a smile, or a helping hand, these gestures become a daily practice that infuses our lives with purpose. Kindness becomes a reflex, and the joy it brings becomes its own reward. 3. The Ripple Effect Spreading love and kindness sets off a chain reaction that extends far beyond our immediate interactions. The positive energy we generate touches the lives of others, inspiring them to pay it forward. In this ripple effect, our kindness multiplies, and the blessings we receive become manifold. For a shift in perspective, acts of kindness and love invite us to see the world through a different lens, one that is focused on the beauty and goodness that surround us. This shift in perspective enriches our own lives, allowing us to find joy in the everyday moments, to cherish the connections we forge, and to appreciate the world's abundant blessings. 5. Strengthening Relationships Kindness deepens our relationships with family, friends, and acquaintances. It fosters trust, respect, and an environment of support. Stronger relationships, in turn, provide us with a network of emotional well-being and a sense of belonging that is invaluable. 6. The Law of Attraction The universe has a way of reciprocating the energy we put out into the world. When we spread love and kindness, we set in motion the Law of Attraction, drawing positivity and blessings toward us. The goodwill we generate is returned to us in various forms, a helping hand when we need it most, unexpected opportunities, and a deep sense of contentment. 7. A life filled with purpose. Spreading love and kindness imbues our lives with a sense of purpose beyond our personal pursuits. It allows us to contribute positively to the well-being of others and leaves an indelible mark on the world. This purpose-driven life is inherently blessed as it aligns with the greater good. In conclusion, spreading love and kindness is not just a selfless act, it is a pathway to receiving the best blessings life has to offer. By cultivating empathy, practicing daily acts of kindness, and nurturing positive relationships, we create a cycle of positivity that enriches our own lives in countless ways. As we embrace this journey, let us remember that the blessings we receive are not only the result of our actions but also a reflection of the love and kindness we carry within us. Chapter 5 Embracing Abundance Introduction In the grand symphony of life, abundance is the melody that resonates with the deepest chords of our souls. It is a concept that extends far beyond material wealth, encompassing the richness of experiences, the depth of relationships, and the bountiful treasures that the universe has to offer. As we step into the realm of Chapter 5, we embark on a profound exploration of embracing abundance, a journey that unveils the secrets of living a life brimming with fulfillment and gratitude. 
Abundance is a state of mind and a way of perceiving the world. It is the realization that there is more than enough love, joy, and opportunity to go around. It is the understanding that scarcity is an illusion and that life's blessings are not finite but abundant, waiting to be claimed by those with open hearts and minds. The concept of embracing abundance is not merely about acquiring material wealth, although financial prosperity can certainly be a part of it. It is about adopting an attitude of appreciation for the abundance that surrounds us in every moment, the beauty of a sunrise, the laughter of a child, the warmth of a friend's embrace, and the boundless potential that lies within. In this chapter, we will delve deep into the essence of embracing abundance, exploring the transformative power it holds in our lives. We will uncover the principles of abundance consciousness, cultivating gratitude as a gateway to abundance, and the art of manifesting our desires through intention and belief. Abundance is not a distant dream, it is a reality waiting to be acknowledged and welcomed into our lives. By understanding the principles and practices that lead to abundance, we unlock the doors to a life filled with prosperity, joy, and an unshakable sense of well-being. As we embark on this journey together, let us set aside the notion of scarcity and embrace the abundant world that surrounds us. Let us learn to see each moment as an opportunity, each experience as a gift, and each day as an invitation to live a life that overflows with blessings. With an open heart and a mindset of abundance, we have the power to shape our reality and create a life that truly reflects the boundless richness of the universe. Shifting from Scarcity to Abundance Mindset At its core, shifting from a scarcity to an abundance mindset is a profound shift in our perception of the world and our place within it. It is a shift from a mindset rooted in fear, lack, and limitation to one that embraces the belief that opportunities, resources, and blessings are abundant and available to us. An abundance mindset is not about being naive or unrealistic, rather, it is about recognizing that our beliefs and perceptions shape our reality. When we adopt an abundance mindset, we open ourselves up to a world of possibilities, optimism, and gratitude. Here's what this transformation means and how we can apply it to our lives. Defining Abundance Mindset An abundance mindset is characterized by the belief that there is more than enough to go around. It acknowledges that the universe is abundant and that scarcity is often a self-imposed limitation. It is a perspective that views challenges as opportunities, failures as stepping stones, and success as something to be celebrated and shared. Shifting our perception To shift from a scarcity to an abundance mindset, we must first become aware of our thought patterns. Scarcity thinking is often rooted in fear, comparison, and a focus on what we lack. Abundance thinking, on the other hand, involves recognizing and appreciating the blessings and opportunities that already exist in our lives. Cultivating Gratitude Gratitude is a powerful catalyst for embracing abundance. When we acknowledge and express gratitude for the abundance that surrounds us, whether it's the love of family and friends, the beauty of nature, or the opportunities for growth, we create a positive feedback loop. Gratitude amplifies abundance, attracting more blessings into our lives. Embracing Opportunity An abundance mindset encourages us to view challenges as opportunities for growth and learning. Instead of fearing failure, we see it as a stepping stone toward success. We become more open to taking calculated risks, pursuing our passions, and seizing the opportunities that come our way. Fostering Generosity Abundance thinking encourages generosity and a willingness to share our blessings with others. When we believe that there is more than enough to go around, we are more inclined to help those in need and contribute to the well-being of our communities. In giving, we often receive even more in return. Creating Intention Intention plays a significant role in shifting our mindset. By setting clear intentions for the abundance we wish to manifest in our lives, we align our thoughts, actions, and beliefs with our desires. Visualization and positive affirmations are powerful tools for reinforcing this intention. Practicing Mindfulness Mindfulness helps us stay present in the moment, appreciating the abundance that exists here and now. It allows us to let go of worries about the future and regrets about the past, fostering a sense of contentment and gratitude for the present. In conclusion, shifting from a scarcity to an abundance mindset is a transformative journey that empowers us to create a life filled with optimism, gratitude, and opportunities. It is a conscious choice to see the world through a different lens, one that celebrates the abundance that surrounds us and invites us to live a life of fulfillment and prosperity. As we embrace this mindset, we open the door to a world of limitless possibilities and boundless blessings. Financial and Material Abundance, Beyond Wealth, Towards Fulfillment In the realm of abundance, financial and material abundance represents just one facet of the rich tapestry of life. 
It's important to recognize that while financial prosperity is a part of this abundance, it is not the sole measure of a blessed existence. True financial and material abundance extends beyond mere wealth and possessions, it is about aligning our resources with our values, desires, and well-being. Defining Financial and Material Abundance Financial abundance encompasses the ability to meet our financial needs, achieve our goals, and enjoy the comforts of life without undue stress or worry. It is a state where we have the resources to support ourselves and our loved ones, pursue our passions, and contribute to causes we care about. Material abundance, on the other hand, is the availability of material possessions that enhance our quality of life. This includes having a comfortable home, access to nutritious food, reliable transportation, and the means to enjoy leisure activities and experiences. Beyond Wealth, Fulfillment and Values Embracing financial and material abundance is not solely about accumulating wealth, it's about aligning our financial resources with our values and aspirations. It's about making choices that lead to a life of fulfillment, purpose, and well-being. It's recognizing that financial abundance should serve as a tool to enhance our overall quality of life, rather than an end in itself. How to Apply Financial and Material Abundance to Our Lives 1. Define your values. Begin by clarifying your core values and priorities. What matters most to you in life? Your values will guide your financial decisions, helping you allocate resources in alignment with what truly brings you joy and fulfillment. 2. Set financial goals. Establish clear financial goals that reflect your values and aspirations. Whether it's saving for a dream vacation, investing in education, or contributing to a charitable cause, having concrete goals gives purpose to your financial journey. 3. Create a budget. Develop a budget that outlines your income, expenses, and savings goals. A well-structured budget helps you manage your finances effectively, ensuring that you allocate resources to areas that matter most. 4. Practice responsible spending. Make mindful spending choices that reflect your values. Consider whether a purchase aligns with your long-term goals and brings genuine satisfaction. Avoid impulsive or frivolous spending that may detract from your financial well-being. 5. Invest wisely. If applicable, invest your money wisely to grow your wealth over time. Seek professional financial advice if needed to make informed investment decisions that align with your goals and risk tolerance. 6. Practice gratitude. Cultivate a sense of gratitude for the financial and material abundance you currently have. Acknowledging and appreciating what you possess fosters contentment and invites more abundance into your life. 7. Give back. Embrace the joy of giving by contributing to causes and organizations that resonate with your values. Generosity not only benefits others but also enhances your sense of fulfillment and purpose. 8. Live mindfully. Practice mindfulness in your financial decisions. Be fully present when managing your finances, making intentional choices that reflect your values and goals. In essence, financial and material abundance is about achieving a harmonious balance between wealth and well-being. It involves leveraging financial resources as a means to lead a fulfilling and purpose-driven life while remaining mindful of the values that guide your journey. When aligned with your values, financial abundance becomes a powerful tool to enhance your overall sense of abundance and well-being. Picture this, a tranquil morning unfolds as the sun bathes the world in its warm, golden glow. You step outside, and your senses awaken to the symphony of life around you. The birds serenade the day with their melodious tunes, and the gentle breeze rustles through the leaves, whispering secrets of ancient wisdom. As you take in this enchanting scene, you realize that abundance is not confined to a single aspect of life, it's a tapestry that weaves through every moment and experience. It's in the vibrant hues of a blooming garden, where flowers dance in harmony with the breeze. It's in the laughter shared with cherished friends, as you create memories that linger in your heart. It's in the rich aroma of a homemade meal, a feast for both your senses and your soul. In this immersive journey, you come to understand that experiencing abundance in all areas of life is about living with open eyes, an open heart, and an open mind. It's about recognizing the blessings that surround you, both big and small, and savoring them with deep gratitude. Abundance reveals itself in the heartwarming embrace of a loved one, in the serendipitous encounters that spark inspiration, and in the moments of solitude where you find peace and inner wisdom. It's the joy of pursuing your passions, the satisfaction of achieving your goals, and the thrill of discovering the limitless potential within yourself. Abundance isn't solely about having, it's about being. It's about being present in the moment, fully engaged with life's wonders. It's about being receptive to the beauty of the world, the wisdom of your experiences, and the kindness of others. As you navigate this journey of abundance, you come to understand that it's not a destination but a way of living. 
It's a mindset that transcends circumstances and invites you to see the world through the lens of possibility, to embrace challenges as opportunities, and to find contentment in the simplest of pleasures. In this vibrant tapestry of life, abundance flows through every thread, weaving a story of gratitude, joy, and fulfillment. It's a story where each chapter is a new adventure, each page a fresh revelation, and each moment an invitation to experience the richness of life in all its splendid forms. So, as you continue your journey through this abundant world, remember that abundance is not a distant treasure, it's a treasure that resides within you and around you, waiting to be discovered in every breath, every smile, and every heartbeat. Embrace it, savor it, and let it fill your life with boundless richness and wonder. Chapter 6, Finding Purpose and Meaning Introduction Purpose and meaning are the compass and the north star of our lives, guiding us through the ever-changing landscapes of our experiences. They are the driving forces that infuse our actions with intention, our days with fulfillment, and our existence with a sense of significance. Defining purpose and meaning Purpose is the beacon that illuminates the path of our lives. It's the answer to the timeless question, why do I exist? Purpose gives our actions direction and motivation, anchoring us in a sense of mission and calling. Meaning is the answer to the question, what makes life worth living? Meaning infuses our lives with depth, connecting us to the profound and transcendent aspects of our existence. Beyond existence, the quest for significance? Finding purpose and meaning goes beyond the mere act of existing, it's about embracing the idea that our lives have a unique and valuable contribution to make to the world. It's recognizing that each of us possesses a potential for greatness and a role to play in the grand symphony of life. The Journey of Discovery the journey of finding purpose and meaning is not a destination but a quest, a quest that often unfolds in stages, evolves with our experiences, and deepens as we grow. It is a journey of self-discovery, self-expression, and self-realization. How to Navigate the Quest In this chapter, we will venture into the intricate dimensions of purpose and meaning. We will delve into the principles of uncovering one's purpose, finding significance in life's challenges, and aligning our lives with our core values and aspirations. We will also explore the significance of mindfulness and the pursuit of passions in nurturing a profound sense of purpose and meaning. In essence, the journey of discovering purpose and meaning is akin to a soulful odyssey, an invitation to delve deep into our inner world, to embrace our unique gifts, and to ensure that our lives resonate with a profound sense of significance. As we embark on this transformative exploration, it's vital to recognize that this path isn't a solitary one, it's a shared journey that connects us with the broader human experience. Each one of us has a vital role to play in the grand story of life. Furthermore, we will discuss the importance of values and priorities. We'll explore how to define these guiding principles that underpin our choices and actions. We will delve into practical strategies for aligning our daily lives with these values and priorities, ensuring that they serve as the compass that directs our actions and decisions. Identifying your passions and purpose, the inner compass of a fulfilled life. Imagine waking up every day with a deep sense of excitement and purpose, driven by a profound connection to your passions. This is the gift of discovering your passions and purpose, a journey that unfolds within the depths of your heart and soul, guiding you toward a life brimming with fulfillment and meaning. Passions, the fire within. Passions are the flames that ignite your soul, the activities and interests that set your heart on fire. They are the pursuits that make you feel alive, energized, and deeply engaged. Identifying your passions is akin to discovering the key that unlocks the door to your innermost desires and dreams. To identify your passions, consider the moments when you feel most alive, when time seems to fly by because you're completely absorbed in what you're doing. What activities make your heart race with enthusiasm? What subjects or hobbies could you explore endlessly without growing tired? Your passions often lie in these experiences, waiting to be uncovered. Purpose, the North Star Purpose is the guiding light that gives your life direction and meaning. It's the understanding of why you're here on this journey called life and the contribution you can make to the world. Discovering your purpose is like finding your North Star, a constant point of reference that guides your decisions and actions. To identify your purpose, reflect on the activities or causes that deeply resonate with you. What issues or challenges in the world touch your heart? What are you naturally drawn to when it comes to making a difference or leaving a positive mark? Your purpose often aligns with these areas of resonance, calling you to contribute your unique gifts and talents. The Intersection of Passions and Purpose The magic happens when your passions intersect with your purpose. It's at this crossroads that you find your true calling, a path where what you love to do aligns with making a meaningful impact on the world. 
This synergy creates a sense of deep fulfillment and a sense of being in the flow of life. Identifying your passions and purpose involves introspection, self-discovery, and a willingness to explore new avenues. It's about listening to your heart, embracing what truly matters to you, and aligning your actions with your core values. It's also about being patient with yourself, as this journey may take time to fully unfold. When you live in alignment with your passions and purpose, every day becomes an opportunity to pursue what you love and make a positive difference. You wake up with a sense of enthusiasm, knowing that your actions have a deeper significance. Your passions and purpose become the inner compass that guides you toward a life of fulfillment, impact, and profound meaning. In conclusion, identifying your passions and purpose is a profound journey of self-discovery and alignment. It's about connecting with the fire within you and embracing the North Star that illuminates your path. When you embark on this journey with an open heart and a curious spirit, you pave the way for a life that is not just lived but truly celebrated, an existence brimming with passions and purpose. Identifying and defining your values and priorities, navigating life's true north. Values and priorities are the compass that guides our decisions, shapes our actions, and ultimately defines the path we take in life. Identifying and defining these guiding principles is an essential journey toward creating a life that aligns with your true self and brings you a sense of fulfillment and purpose. Values, the core beliefs. Values are the fundamental beliefs that define what matters most to you in life. They are the guiding principles that influence your attitudes, behaviors, and choices. Values serve as the foundation upon which you build your life, shaping your character and driving your actions. To identify your values, take time for introspection. Reflect on the principles and beliefs that resonate deeply with you. What qualities and virtues do you admire in others? What aspects of life do you consider non-negotiable? Your values often lie in these aspects of your identity. Some common values include integrity, compassion, family, creativity, and honesty. Priorities, the focus choices. Priorities are the specific areas or goals in your life that hold the greatest importance at a given moment. They represent where you choose to invest your time, energy, and resources. Priorities are dynamic and may shift as circumstances change, but they provide clarity on what deserves your attention at any given time. Identifying your priorities involves evaluating your current life circumstances and goals. What are the most pressing needs and aspirations in your life right now? What are the long-term goals you want to pursue? Priorities can encompass various aspects, including career, family, personal growth, health, and relationships. Defining and applying your values and priorities. 1. Self-reflection. Begin by engaging in deep self-reflection. Take time to explore your thoughts, feelings, and experiences. Journaling or meditation can be valuable tools for gaining insights into your core values and priorities. 2. List your values. Make a list of the values that resonate with you. This list is a starting point for defining your principles. Consider what each value means to you personally. 3. Evaluate priorities. Assess your current life circumstances and goals. Identify the areas that require your immediate attention and those that align with your long-term aspirations. 4. Align with goals. Ensure that your values and priorities align with your life goals and aspirations. Your values should serve as a guiding force in shaping your priorities. 5. Integrate into daily life. Apply your values and priorities to your daily life. Make conscious choices that reflect these principles in your actions and decisions. 6. Communicate and adapt. Share your values and priorities with loved ones to foster understanding and alignment. Be open to adapting your priorities as circumstances change. 7. Balance and re-evaluate. Regularly assess your values and priorities to ensure they remain in harmony with your evolving life journey. Strive for a balance that promotes your well-being and fulfillment. In conclusion, identifying and defining your values and priorities is a transformative journey of self-discovery and self-alignment. It involves understanding what truly matters to you and making intentional choices that reflect these principles in your life. When your values and priorities serve as your compass, you navigate life's complexities with clarity, purpose, and a sense of authenticity, ultimately leading to a life that resonates with your true self. Aligning your actions with your values and priorities, the path to authentic living. Aligning your actions with your values and priorities is the bridge that connects your inner beliefs and aspirations to the tangible experiences of your daily life. It's the transformative process of turning your principles into purposeful actions, creating a life that resonates with authenticity, fulfillment, and a sense of purpose. Understanding the connection. 
The alignment of actions with values and priorities is the cornerstone of living authentically. It's about translating your core beliefs into intentional choices that guide your behavior, decisions, and interactions with the world. When your actions are in harmony with your values, you experience a profound sense of integrity and inner congruence. Intentional decision-making To align your actions, begin with mindful decision-making. Whenever you face choices or dilemmas, pause and consider how each option aligns with your values and priorities. Ask yourself whether a particular choice resonates with your core principles or detracts from them. Setting clear intentions Setting clear intentions is another crucial step in the alignment process. Clearly define your goals and aspirations, making sure they are in alignment with your values and priorities. These intentions serve as a roadmap, guiding your actions toward the realization of your deepest desires. Mindful execution As you go about your daily activities, practice mindfulness in your actions. Pay attention to the present moment and the choices you make. Ensure that your actions reflect the values and priorities you hold dear. This requires conscious effort and a commitment to authenticity. Regular evaluation Periodically evaluate the alignment of your actions with your values and priorities. Life is dynamic and circumstances change. What once felt aligned may require adjustment over time. Regular reflection allows you to adapt and realign as needed. Balancing priorities Balancing competing priorities is a vital aspect of alignment. Sometimes, you may need to make choices between conflicting values or immediate and long-term priorities. Finding a harmonious balance that respects your core principles is key to maintaining alignment. Consistent practice Alignment is not a one-time achievement but an ongoing practice. It involves a commitment to living authentically each day. Consistent effort and self-awareness are essential for maintaining this alignment as you navigate life's complexities. The Rewards of Alignment When your actions are aligned with your values and priorities, you experience a profound sense of fulfillment, inner peace, and authenticity. You live a life that is congruent with your true self, fostering a deep sense of purpose and a harmonious connection with the world around you. Aligning your actions with your values and priorities is the journey of embodying your true self. It's a conscious choice to live in accordance with your deepest principles, creating a life that reflects your authenticity and purpose. As you commit to this alignment, you pave the way for a life that resonates with meaning and fulfillment, guided by the compass of your own beliefs and aspirations. Serving others and giving back, the heartfelt joy of making a difference. There's a simple and beautiful truth in life, one of the most meaningful things we can do is to serve others and give back to our communities. It's a powerful way to spread kindness, make the world a better place, and experience a profound sense of joy. The Gift of Giving When we serve others and give back, we offer the gift of our time, skills, and love. It can be as small as lending a helping hand to a neighbor or as big as volunteering for a noble cause. Each act of kindness, no matter the size, has the power to brighten someone's day and fill their heart with gratitude. Spreading Positivity Serving others is like planting seeds of positivity in the world. When you help someone in need, offer a listening ear, or simply share a smile, you create ripples of goodness that extend far beyond the moment. Your actions inspire others to do the same, creating a chain reaction of kindness. The Joy of Connection Giving back connects us to our shared humanity. It reminds us that we are all part of a larger community, bound by our capacity for compassion and empathy. When we serve others, we strengthen the bonds that unite us and create a world where kindness and understanding thrive. Simple Acts – Big Impact You don't need grand gestures to make a difference. Simple acts of kindness can have a big impact. Hold the door open for someone, donate to a local charity, or volunteer your time at a community event. These small actions add up to a world filled with love and generosity. The Feel-Good Factor Perhaps the most beautiful part of serving others is the feel-good factor. When you give back, you experience a deep sense of joy and fulfillment. It's a heartwarming feeling that reminds you of the goodness in the world and the happiness that comes from making someone else's life a little brighter. Conclusion of Chapter 6, Finding Purpose and Meaning In this chapter, we embarked on a profound journey of self-discovery, exploring the essence of purpose and meaning in our lives. We learned that purpose serves as our guiding beacon, directing our actions with intention and anchoring us in a sense of mission. On the other hand, meaning infuses our existence with depth and connects us to the profound aspects of our human experience. We recognize that finding purpose and meaning isn't just about existing, it's about embracing our unique contribution to the world's grand symphony. 
This quest of self-discovery unfolds in stages, evolving with our experiences and deepening as we grow. We discussed practical strategies for navigating this quest, including identifying passions and aligning them with our purpose. Furthermore, we explored the importance of values and priorities, recognizing them as the compass that directs our actions. With newfound clarity, we are better equipped to pursue a life brimming with passions, purpose, and a profound sense of significance. Chapter 7 Overcoming Life's Challenges Introduction Life is a journey filled with both joys and trials. Along this winding path, we encounter obstacles, setbacks, and moments of uncertainty. These challenges are an inevitable part of the human experience, and they test our resilience, strength, and determination. In this chapter, we delve into the art of overcoming life's challenges, a journey that requires courage, adaptability, and a steadfast belief in our ability to rise above adversity. The Nature of Challenges Challenges come in various forms, from personal struggles and unexpected hardships to professional setbacks and societal pressures. They may manifest as health issues, financial difficulties, relationship hurdles, or moments of self-doubt. While the nature of challenges varies, one thing remains constant, they provide us with opportunities for growth and transformation. The Power of Resilience Resilience is our capacity to bounce back from adversity, to learn and grow stronger through life's trials. It is a skill we can cultivate, enabling us to navigate challenges with grace and determination. Resilience empowers us to see difficulties as stepping stones rather than roadblocks, allowing us to harness the lessons they offer. The Growth Mindset Having a growth mindset is essential when facing challenges. It means embracing the belief that our abilities and intelligence can be developed through dedication and hard work. With this mindset, we approach challenges as opportunities to learn, innovate, and persevere, rather than as insurmountable barriers. The Role of Perspective Perspective is a powerful tool in overcoming challenges. By shifting our viewpoint, we can reframe difficulties as experiences that shape our character and build our resilience. Challenges can become catalysts for personal growth, leading us to discover hidden strengths and untapped potentials. Navigating the Chapter in the pages ahead, we will explore the art of overcoming life's challenges through practical strategies and insights. We will delve into the importance of resilience, the growth mindset, and the transformative power of perspective. Additionally, we will provide guidance on how to navigate specific challenges that you may encounter in various aspects of life, from health and relationships to career and personal development. As we embark on this journey of overcoming life's challenges, let us remember that adversity is not a sign of weakness but an opportunity to showcase our strength. With the right mindset and tools, we can navigate life's trials with resilience and emerge from them stronger, wiser, and more empowered than ever before. Resilience and Coping Strategies – Thriving Through Life's Challenges Resilience is the remarkable ability to bounce back from adversity, to weather life's storms with grace, and to emerge from challenges stronger and wiser than before. It's a quality we can cultivate and refine, empowering us to navigate the ups and downs of life with unwavering determination and a positive outlook. In this section, we'll explore the essence of resilience, delve into various coping strategies, and provide examples of how to apply them to your life. Defining Resilience Resilience is the capacity to adapt and recover in the face of adversity, trauma, or significant stress. It involves not just surviving but thriving despite life's challenges. Resilient individuals possess emotional strength, flexibility, and an innate ability to find meaning in difficult experiences. Exploring Coping Strategies Coping strategies are the tools and techniques we use to manage stress, adversity, and challenges. They serve as our emotional and psychological armor, helping us navigate difficult situations while maintaining our well-being. Here are some coping strategies to consider. 1. Positive reframing. This involves changing your perspective on a challenging situation. Instead of dwelling on the negative aspects, focus on potential growth and learning opportunities. For example, if facing a career setback, view it as a chance to explore new career paths. 2. Emotional regulation. Practice emotional regulation techniques like deep breathing, mindfulness, or meditation. These methods help you stay calm and composed during stressful times, allowing for more rational decision-making. 3. Social support. Reach out to friends, family, or support groups. Sharing your challenges and seeking emotional support can provide comfort and reduce feelings of isolation. Connecting with others who have faced similar situations can be especially helpful. 4. Problem solving. Identify the specific challenges you're facing and work on finding practical solutions. 
break down complex problems into smaller, manageable steps. For instance, if dealing with financial difficulties, create a budget and explore ways to increase income or reduce expenses. 5. Self-care. Prioritize self-care practices, including regular exercise, a balanced diet, adequate sleep, and relaxation techniques. Taking care of your physical and mental health is crucial for building resilience. 6. Seek professional help. Don't hesitate to consult with mental health professionals or therapists if needed. They can provide guidance, therapy, and strategies tailored to your specific challenges. Applying coping strategies to your life. Let's consider an example of how to apply these coping strategies in a real-life scenario. Scenario Job Loss Positive reframing Instead of viewing job loss as a failure, see it as an opportunity to explore new career paths or acquire new skills. Focus on personal growth and the chance to pursue a more fulfilling career. Emotional regulation Practice deep breathing or mindfulness exercises to manage the stress and anxiety that often accompany job loss. Stay calm and collected while you prepare for your next career move. Social support, lean on your friends and family for emotional support during this challenging time. Share your feelings and concerns with loved ones who can offer encouragement and empathy. Problem solving, create a detailed plan for finding a new job. Update your resume, network with industry professionals, and explore job opportunities. Break the process into smaller, manageable tasks. Self-care. Prioritize self-care by maintaining a healthy daily routine. Ensure you're getting enough rest, eating nutritious meals, and engaging in physical activity to boost your overall well-being. Seek professional help. If you find it challenging to cope with the emotional toll of job loss, consider seeking guidance from a career counselor or therapist who can provide tailored support. In conclusion, resilience and coping strategies are essential tools for navigating life's challenges. By understanding the nature of resilience and implementing coping strategies like positive reframing, emotional regulation, seeking social support, problem-solving, practicing self-care, and seeking professional help when necessary, you can not only survive but thrive in the face of adversity. Remember that building resilience is an ongoing process, and with persistence and self-compassion, you can strengthen your ability to overcome life's hurdles. Turning setbacks into opportunities, embracing growth through adversity. Life is a journey filled with unexpected twists and turns, and setbacks are an inevitable part of this adventure. Whether it's a personal crisis, a career stumble, or a sudden change in circumstances, setbacks can leave us feeling disheartened and overwhelmed. However, it's essential to recognize that within every setback lies the potential for growth and transformation. In this section, we will explore how to turn setbacks into opportunities and how journaling can be a valuable tool in this process. Understanding Setbacks Setbacks can take many forms, and their impact varies from person to person. They can manifest as job losses, relationship challenges, health issues, or personal disappointments. When we face setbacks, it's natural to experience a range of emotions, including frustration, sadness, and uncertainty. However, it's crucial to remember that setbacks are not failures, they are opportunities in disguise. Shift your perspective. The first step in turning setbacks into opportunities is to shift your perspective. Instead of viewing setbacks as roadblocks, see them as detours on your journey toward personal growth and self-discovery. Embrace the belief that challenges offer valuable lessons and the chance to build resilience. Embrace adaptability. Adaptability is a key trait when it comes to navigating setbacks. Life rarely goes according to plan, and the ability to adapt to changing circumstances is essential. Be open to new possibilities and be willing to adjust your goals and expectations as needed. Journaling as a tool. Journaling is a powerful tool for identifying setbacks, processing emotions, and navigating them into opportunities. Here's how journaling can help. 1. Emotional release. Writing in a journal allows you to express your thoughts and emotions freely. This emotional release can provide relief and clarity during challenging times. 2. Reflection. Journaling encourages self-reflection. You can explore the root causes of setbacks and gain insights into your reactions and feelings. 3. Identifying patterns. By journaling consistently, you may start to notice patterns in your setbacks. This awareness can help you make proactive changes in your life to avoid similar challenges in the future. For goal setting, journaling can assist you in setting new goals and aspirations. It allows you to articulate your desires and create a roadmap for moving forward. Navigating setbacks into opportunities. To turn setbacks into opportunities, consider the following steps. 
1. Journal your experience, start by journaling about the setback itself. Describe the situation, your emotions, and your initial reactions. This process can help you gain clarity about the nature of the setback. 2. Seek lessons, reflect on what you can learn from the setback. Ask yourself what skills, knowledge, or insights you've gained from the experience. Consider how these lessons can be applied to future opportunities. 3. Set new goals. Use your journal to set new goals or revise existing ones. Identify the opportunities that may arise from the setback and create a plan to pursue them. 4. Embrace resilience. Recognize the resilience you've developed in overcoming setbacks. Use this resilience as a source of strength as you move forward. 5. Stay positive. Maintain a positive outlook. Focus on your strengths and past achievements, reminding yourself that setbacks are temporary obstacles on your path to success. In conclusion, setbacks are not the end of the road, they are the beginning of a new journey. By shifting your perspective, embracing adaptability, and using journaling as a tool for self-reflection, you can navigate setbacks into opportunities for growth and transformation. Remember that setbacks are an integral part of the human experience, and they often lead to unexpected and fulfilling paths in life. Growing through adversity, nurturing resilience and self-discovery. Adversity is a constant companion on life's journey, and while it may bring challenges and hardships, it also carries the potential for profound growth and self-discovery. Growing through adversity is a testament to the resilience of the human spirit, a journey of transformation that reshapes our character, deepens our understanding of ourselves, and opens the door to new possibilities. Resilience in Action Resilience is the inner strength that allows us to bounce back from adversity. It's the capacity to endure setbacks, learn from failures, and emerge from difficult times with newfound wisdom and strength. Adversity tests our resilience, pushing us to adapt, evolve, and develop coping mechanisms that we may not have discovered otherwise. Embracing Change Adversity often requires us to embrace change and step outside our comfort zones. It challenges us to re-evaluate our priorities, values, and goals, prompting personal growth and self-reflection. While change can be daunting, it's through adversity that we often discover our true potential and the ability to thrive in new circumstances. Self-discovery Adversity invites us to embark on a journey of self-discovery. It prompts us to ask profound questions about our values, purpose, and the meaning of our experiences. In the face of adversity, we may uncover hidden talents, passions, and strengths that we were previously unaware of. It's a process of getting to know ourselves on a deeper level. Building Resilient Skills Growing through adversity involves developing resilient skills that serve us well throughout life. These skills include adaptability, emotional regulation, problem-solving, and a growth mindset. Each challenge we encounter provides an opportunity to refine these skills, making us more capable of facing future adversity with courage and grace. Finding Meaning In the midst of adversity, we often seek meaning in our experiences. We search for silver linings, lessons learned, and ways to turn difficult situations into opportunities for growth. Finding meaning in adversity can be a source of comfort and motivation, helping us persevere through tough times. Support and Connection While personal growth is a deeply internal process, seeking support and connection with others is essential. Sharing our experiences, seeking guidance, and offering support to those facing similar challenges can be a source of strength and resilience. Human connection reminds us that we are not alone on this journey. In conclusion, growing through adversity is a testament to the human spirit's capacity to endure and thrive. It's a journey that reshapes our character, deepens our self-understanding, and strengthens our resilience. When faced with adversity, we have the opportunity to rise above our circumstances, embrace change, and discover the hidden potential within us. Adversity, though challenging, can be the catalyst for personal growth and a source of strength that guides us through life's complexities. Chapter 8 Living a Balanced Life In the modern world, with its relentless pace and ceaseless demands, finding balance has become a precious aspiration. The pursuit of a balanced life is not merely a quest for equilibrium between work and leisure, but an intricate dance between various facets of our existence. It's a harmonious blend of personal growth, relationships, health, and the pursuit of our passions. This chapter explores the art of living a balanced life, a life where the scales are not tilted by extremes, but carefully calibrated to honor our physical, emotional, and spiritual well-being. In the pages that follow, we will journey through the multifaceted dimensions of balance, discovering how it extends far beyond the boundaries of time management. 
True balance is a state of inner harmony where our actions align with our values, where self-care becomes a priority, and where we nurture the connections that enrich our lives. We will explore the importance of setting boundaries, managing stress, and fostering resilience to maintain this equilibrium. Moreover, we will delve into the significance of aligning our actions with our aspirations, ensuring that our daily choices reflect our deepest intentions. Living a balanced life is not a destination but a continuous journey, a dance between the various roles we play and the values we hold dear. It's an acknowledgement that our well-being encompasses not only our physical health but also our emotional and spiritual fulfillment. As we embark on this exploration, let us remember that the path to balance is a personal one, shaped by our unique values, desires, and circumstances. In the end, living a balanced life is an ongoing commitment to nurturing the most precious gift we have ourselves. Work-life balance, priorities and commitments in harmony. Work-life balance is a delicate equilibrium between the demands of our professional lives and the pursuit of personal well-being and fulfillment. It's a concept deeply rooted in the interplay between our priorities and commitments, a dynamic that shapes our daily choices and ultimately defines the quality of our lives. Defining Priorities The foundation of work-life balance rests on our ability to define and prioritize what truly matters to us. Our priorities are the guiding stars that illuminate our path, dictating where we invest our time, energy, and attention. Identifying our priorities is a deeply personal process, shaped by our values, goals, and aspirations. When we understand our priorities, we can make intentional choices that align with our true desires. Balancing Commitments Commitments are the responsibilities and obligations we undertake in both our professional and personal spheres. They include work deadlines, family responsibilities, social engagements, and personal goals. Achieving work-life balance requires skillful navigation of these commitments to ensure they do not overwhelm us. It involves setting boundaries, managing expectations, and making conscious choices about how we allocate our resources. Setting Boundaries One of the cornerstones of work-life balance is the ability to set clear and healthy boundaries. Boundaries help us establish limits on our time and energy, preventing burnout and preserving our well-being. They allow us to protect our personal time and ensure that our commitments do not encroach upon the areas of our lives that require attention and nurturing. Managing Stress Stress often arises when our commitments and priorities are out of alignment. Effective stress management involves recognizing the signs of imbalance and taking proactive steps to address them. This may include seeking support, delegating tasks, or re-evaluating our commitments to restore equilibrium. Fostering Resilience Resilience is the capacity to bounce back from challenges and setbacks, and it plays a crucial role in maintaining work-life balance. Developing resilience allows us to adapt to changing circumstances and recover from stress more effectively. Building resilience involves self-care, a strong support network, and a growth mindset that views challenges as opportunities for growth. Aligning with Values Work-life balance is not solely about time management but also about ensuring that our commitments align with our values. When our actions reflect our core beliefs and priorities, we experience a deeper sense of fulfillment and authenticity. Regularly evaluating our commitments in the context of our values helps us make decisions that are in harmony with our true selves. In conclusion, work-life balance is an ongoing process of aligning our priorities and commitments to create a life that reflects our values and aspirations. It's about recognizing that balance is not a static state but a dynamic interplay between the various facets of our lives. By setting clear priorities, managing commitments, establishing boundaries, and fostering resilience, we can achieve a work-life balance that enhances our well-being and allows us to live in harmony with our true selves. Living a balanced life, health and wellness. Maintaining a balanced life includes nurturing your physical health and overall wellness. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to help you achieve this harmony. 1. Self-assessment. Begin by assessing your current health and wellness. Reflect on your eating habits, physical activity, sleep patterns, and stress levels. Identify areas that require improvement. 2. Define your goals. Set clear and achievable health and wellness goals. These goals should be specific, measurable, and aligned with your values. Examples include losing weight, eating a balanced diet, or reducing stress. 3. Nutrition and diet. Pay attention to your diet. Aim for a balanced intake of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and healthy fats. Avoid excessive processed foods, sugar, and excessive caffeine or alcohol consumption. For regular exercise, 
Incorporate regular physical activity into your routine. Choose activities you enjoy, whether it's jogging, dancing, yoga, or sports. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise per week. 5. Adequate rest. Prioritize quality sleep. Aim for 7 to 9 hours of sleep each night. Create a sleep friendly environment, establish a consistent bedtime routine, and limit screen time before bed. 6. Stress management. Develop stress management techniques such as mindfulness meditation, deep breathing exercises, or yoga. Learn to identify and address sources of stress in your life. 7. Stay hydrated. Drink plenty of water throughout the day to stay hydrated. Avoid excessive sugary beverages and monitor your caffeine intake. 8. Regular check UPS. Schedule regular health checkups with your healthcare provider. These visits help monitor your overall health and catch potential issues early. 9. Time management. Manage your time effectively to avoid overcommitting and becoming overwhelmed. Prioritize your health by scheduling time for exercise, meal preparation, and relaxation. 10. Balance work and leisure. Allocate time for leisure activities, hobbies, and spending quality time with loved ones. Avoid overworking or bringing work-related stress home. 11. Mindful eating. Practice mindful eating by savoring each bite, eating slowly, and paying attention to hunger and fullness cues. Avoid emotional eating and mindless snacking. 12. Stay informed. Stay informed about health and wellness trends and guidelines. Keep up with the latest information on nutrition, exercise, and overall well-being. 13. Seek support. Don't hesitate to seek support from healthcare professionals, nutritionists, personal trainers, or therapists if needed. Surround yourself with a supportive community that encourages your wellness journey. 14. Consistency is key. Remember that living a balanced life is an ongoing process. Consistency is crucial for long-term success. Be patient with yourself and stay committed to your health and wellness goals. 15. Celebrate achievements. Celebrate your achievements and milestones along the way. Recognize and reward yourself for your efforts to maintain a balanced and healthy life. Balancing your health and wellness is a lifelong journey that requires dedication and self-care. By following these steps and making them part of your daily routine, you can achieve and maintain a state of overall well-being and live a truly balanced life. Living a balanced life, pursuing your hobbies and interests. A balanced life is not just about meeting responsibilities and maintaining health, it also entails nurturing your passions and interests. Embracing hobbies and pursuits that bring you joy and fulfillment is a vital component of this equilibrium. Rediscovering Passion in the hustle and bustle of daily life, it's easy to neglect the activities that ignite your inner spark. Take a moment to reflect on what genuinely excites you. Whether it's painting, playing a musical instrument, hiking, cooking, or any other hobby, these interests are the windows to your soul's contentment. The power of play. Engaging in hobbies allows you to tap into the childlike wonder of exploration and creativity. It's a form of play that rejuvenates your spirit and provides an escape from the routine. It reminds you that life is not just about work, it's about living and savoring every moment. Balancing Commitments Incorporating hobbies into your life requires balancing your commitments. Allocate time for your interests, just as you would for work, family, and self-care. This deliberate act of carving out moments for your passions ensures that you don't lose touch with what truly fulfills you. Mindful Presence When you immerse yourself in your hobbies, you enter a state of mindful presence. The worries of the day fade into the background and you become wholly absorbed in the activity at hand. This mindfulness offers mental rejuvenation and a break from the stresses of daily life. Strengthening Connections Sharing hobbies with loved ones can strengthen bonds and create memorable experiences. Whether it's painting with friends, hiking with family, or joining a community of like-minded enthusiasts, these shared interests foster deeper connections and provide opportunities for shared joy. Fulfillment and Purpose Hobbies and interests bring a sense of purpose and fulfillment to your life. They remind you of what makes you unique and what makes life worth living. Pursuing your passions infuses your days with a sense of accomplishment and an appreciation for the diverse facets of your identity. In conclusion, integrating hobbies and interests into your life is a powerful way to nurture your well-being and create a sense of balance. These pursuits allow you to rediscover your passions, experience the joy of play, and cultivate mindful presence. By prioritizing your hobbies, you enrich your life with purpose and fulfillment, creating a harmonious balance between responsibilities and personal passions.
Chapter 9, Practicing Faith and Spirituality Faith and spirituality are integral aspects of the human experience, offering profound avenues for connection, reflection, and inner peace. In this chapter, we delve into the practice of faith and spirituality, exploring how these dimensions can enrich your life and contribute to your overall sense of balance and well-being. Regardless of your specific beliefs or religious affiliation, the principles discussed here offer valuable insights into the transformative power of faith and spirituality in nurturing a balanced and fulfilling life. Join us on a journey of self-discovery, reflection, and spiritual exploration as we explore the profound significance of faith and spirituality in your quest for balance and purpose. Exploring Spirituality, A Journey Within Spirituality is a deeply personal and multifaceted dimension of the human experience. It encompasses our connection to the sacred, our search for meaning, and our sense of purpose in the vast tapestry of existence. While spirituality often finds expression through religious beliefs and practices, it extends beyond the confines of any one faith tradition. Inner Exploration At its core, spirituality invites us to embark on an inner journey, a quest to discover our true essence and connection to something greater than ourselves. This exploration leads us to contemplate the profound questions of existence, purpose, and the nature of reality. Seeking Meaning One of the central themes of spirituality is the pursuit of meaning. It encourages us to explore the significance of our experiences, the mysteries of life and death, and the role we play in the unfolding story of the universe. Through spirituality, we seek to make sense of the world and our place in it. Connecting with the Sacred Spirituality often involves a deep connection with the sacred or divine. This connection may manifest as a relationship with a higher power, a reverence for the natural world, or an appreciation of the transcendent aspects of life. It provides solace, inspiration, and a sense of belonging to something greater. Practices and Rituals Spiritual exploration is often facilitated through practices and rituals. These may include meditation, prayer, mindfulness, or engaging in sacred ceremonies. Such practices offer a means to cultivate a deeper connection with the spiritual realm and foster inner growth. Transcending Boundaries What makes spirituality unique is its ability to transcend religious and cultural boundaries. It can be a unifying force, bringing people of diverse backgrounds together in the quest for higher understanding, compassion, and a shared sense of humanity. A Personal Journey Spirituality is a deeply personal journey, and there is no one-size-fits-all approach. Each person's exploration is unique, shaped by their beliefs, experiences, and the questions that stir their soul. Whether you find solace in traditional religious practices or seek spiritual connection through nature, art, or philosophy, your journey is valid and significant. In essence, exploring spirituality is an inward odyssey, an opportunity to delve into the depths of your being, contemplate life's mysteries, and cultivate a sense of connection and purpose. It is a journey that invites you to embrace the sacred, seek meaning, and find resonance with the profound dimensions of existence. As you embark on this exploration, may you discover the transformative power of spirituality in nurturing your soul and enriching your path toward balance and fulfillment. Connecting with Higher Power, a Source of Strength The quest to connect with a higher power is a fundamental aspect of spirituality that transcends religious affiliations. It represents a profound desire to tap into a force beyond our understanding, a source of wisdom, guidance, and solace that provides strength in times of need. Many individuals find comfort in the belief that there is a higher power, a benevolent force that watches over them and guides their path. This connection often involves seeking divine guidance through prayer, meditation, or contemplation. It is a source of reassurance, knowing that one is not alone on life's journey. Connecting with a higher power brings a sense of purpose and meaning to life. It fosters a belief that there is a greater plan and every experience, whether joyful or challenging, serves a higher purpose. This perspective can provide solace during times of adversity and a sense of fulfillment in everyday life. Faith is at the core of this connection. It involves placing trust in a higher power, surrendering control, and accepting that there are aspects of life beyond our comprehension. This trust can be a source of comfort, helping individuals navigate uncertainty and find peace in the midst of turmoil. A Path to Inner Peace Finding peace and serenity amidst life's storms Life is filled with storms, times of chaos, uncertainty, and adversity. In these moments, the pursuit of inner peace and serenity becomes a profound and necessary endeavor. It is a journey that enables us to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. Inner peace begins with the embrace of stillness. 
It is in moments of quiet reflection, meditation, or simply being present in the here and now that we find respite from the external noise. Stillness allows us to reconnect with our inner selves and discover a sense of tranquility. Finding peace often involves the practice of acceptance and letting go. It is the recognition that we cannot control everything in life, but we can control our responses. Letting go of the need for control and accepting what is enables us to release the burdens of worry and anxiety. Mindfulness, the art of being fully present in the moment, provides a pathway to serenity. By focusing on the present rather than dwelling on the past or worrying about the future, we can find peace in the simplicity of each moment. Self-compassion is an essential component of inner peace. It involves treating ourselves with the same kindness and understanding that we extend to others. Embracing self-compassion allows us to let go of self-criticism and judgment, fostering a sense of serenity. Connection with Nature Nature has a remarkable ability to evoke a sense of peace and serenity. Spending time in natural settings, whether it's a forest, a beach, or a park, can provide solace and rejuvenate the spirit. The beauty and tranquility of the natural world remind us of the inherent harmony in the universe. Gratitude is a powerful tool in the pursuit of inner peace. By focusing on the blessings in our lives, we shift our perspective from scarcity to abundance. Cultivating gratitude opens our hearts to joy and contentment. Support systems Seeking support from loved ones, friends, or a spiritual community can also nurture inner peace. Connecting with others who share similar values and aspirations provides a sense of belonging and strengthens our emotional well-being. In essence, connecting with a higher power and finding inner peace are intertwined journeys that offer solace and strength. Whether through spiritual practices or the pursuit of serenity, both paths lead to a deeper understanding of life's complexities and a greater capacity to navigate its challenges with grace and resilience. Chapter 10, Creating Your Blessed Life Plan In this culminating chapter, we embark on a transformative journey to design your very own blessed life plan, a personalized roadmap for living a life of purpose, balance, and fulfillment. Drawing from the wisdom and insights gathered throughout this book, we will craft a comprehensive plan that aligns with your values, priorities, passions, and spiritual beliefs. Mapping Your Path to Blessings Creating a blessed life plan is about translating your aspirations into actionable steps that honor your unique journey. We will explore how to set meaningful goals, define your priorities, and identify the practical strategies that will empower you to lead a life that resonates with blessings. Key Elements of Your Plan in this chapter, we will delve into the critical components of your blessed life plan, including 1. Defining your values and priorities. We will revisit the importance of these guiding principles, helping you refine and prioritize them to align with your current life stage and aspirations. 2. Setting purposeful goals. Discover the art of setting goals that are in harmony with your values and priorities. We will explore techniques for crafting clear, achievable, and inspiring objectives. 3. Incorporating Spiritual Practices For those on a spiritual journey, we will discuss how to incorporate practices that nurture your connection with a higher power and provide spiritual guidance. 4. Balancing Your Life We will revisit the concept of balance and explore how to integrate your priorities into a harmonious and fulfilling life. 5. Monitoring and Adjusting Your Plan Life is dynamic and your blessed life plan will evolve with it. We will discuss strategies for regularly assessing and adapting your plan to ensure it remains relevant and resonant. A personalized guide to fulfillment. Your blessed life plan is a deeply personal and dynamic document that reflects your unique aspirations and values. It serves as a compass, guiding you toward a life rich in blessings, purpose, and joy. This chapter will provide you with the tools and insights to create a plan that empowers you to live your best life, one filled with gratitude, balance, and fulfillment. Setting Goals and Intentions, Charting Your Course to Fulfillment Setting goals and intentions is a transformative practice that empowers you to shape your life according to your deepest desires and aspirations. It's a deliberate act of envisioning the life you want to lead and creating a roadmap to get there. In this section, we will explore how to set meaningful goals and intentions, apply them to your current life, and provide words of encouragement to keep you motivated on this empowering journey. Defining Your Goals and Intentions 1. Clarify your vision. Start by envisioning your ideal life. What does it look like? What are your most cherished dreams and aspirations? This clarity will serve as the foundation for setting your goals and intentions. 2. Specificity is key. To transform your dreams into reality, make your goals and intentions as specific as possible. Define what you want to achieve, when you want to achieve it, and why it matters to you. 
3. Align with your values. Ensure that your goals and intentions are in harmony with your core values and priorities. This alignment ensures that your pursuits resonate with your authentic self. Applying goals and intentions to your life. 1. Break it down. Divide your goals into manageable steps or milestones. This makes them less daunting and allows you to track your progress. 2. Create an action plan. Develop a practical action plan outlining the steps you need to take to achieve your goals. Set deadlines and prioritize tasks. 3. Stay flexible. Life is unpredictable. Be prepared to adapt your goals and intentions as circumstances change. Flexibility is a key to resilience. Words of encouragement. Believe in yourself, trust in your abilities and your capacity to achieve your goals. Self-belief is the cornerstone of success. Embrace challenges. Challenges are opportunities for growth. Each obstacle you overcome brings you closer to your dreams. Stay persistent. Persistence is often the key to achieving your goals. Keep moving forward even when progress seems slow. Celebrate milestones. Celebrate your achievements along the way. Recognize your progress and use it as motivation to keep going. Seek support. Don't be afraid to lean on friends, family, or mentors for encouragement and guidance. You don't have to navigate this journey alone. Daily rituals for a blessed life. Daily rituals can play a significant role in cultivating a blessed life. These simple, intentional practices can help you stay connected to your values, maintain a positive mindset, and foster gratitude and fulfillment. Here's a guide to daily rituals for a blessed life. 1. Morning Gratitude Begin your day by reflecting on the things you're grateful for. Write down three to five things that bring you joy or appreciation. This sets a positive tone for the day. 2. Mindful Meditation Dedicate a few minutes to meditation or mindfulness exercises. Focus on your breath, clear your mind, and center yourself for the day ahead. 3. Affirmations Use positive affirmations to boost your self-confidence and mindset. Repeat affirmations that resonate with you, such as a I am capable, g I am grateful, or g I am blessed. 4. Healthy breakfast Fuel your body with a nutritious breakfast. A balanced meal sets a healthy tone for the rest of the day and supports your overall well-being. 5. Prioritize tasks. Make a to-do list or prioritize your tasks for the day. This helps you stay organized and focused on your goals and intentions. 6. Connect with loved ones. Reach out to friends or family members with a simple message or call. Connection and relationships contribute to a sense of blessings. 7. Practice acts of kindness. Look for opportunities to perform acts of kindness throughout the day. Small gestures, like holding the door for someone or complimenting a colleague, can make a big difference. 8. Reflect on challenges. When faced with difficulties or challenges, take a moment to reflect on what you can learn from them. Find the silver lining and embrace growth. 9. Lunch break mindfulness. Use your lunch break as an opportunity for mindfulness. Enjoy your meal without distractions, savoring each bite. 10. Afternoon gratitude. Take a moment in the afternoon to express gratitude again. Acknowledge the positive aspects of your day, even the small ones. 11. Exercise or movement. Incorporate physical activity into your day, whether it's a workout, yoga, or a walk. Movement promotes well-being and positivity. 12. Disconnect from technology. Dedicate some time to disconnect from screens and engage in offline activities that nourish your mind and soul. 13. Evening Reflection. Reflect on your day before bedtime. Consider what went well, what you learned, and what you're thankful for. 14. Quality sleep. Prioritize a good night's sleep. Quality rest is essential for physical and emotional well-being. 15. Visualization. Before sleep, visualize your goals and intentions coming to fruition. Imagine your blessed life and the fulfillment of your aspirations. These daily rituals are not about perfection but consistency. By integrating these practices into your daily routine, you can enhance your sense of blessings, maintain a positive outlook, and create a life that resonates with fulfillment and gratitude. Sustaining your journey towards a more blessed life. Embarking on a journey to live a more blessed life is a powerful endeavor, but sustaining that journey over time can be both challenging and rewarding. Here, we'll explore some key strategies to help you stay the course and continue cultivating the blessed life you desire. 1. Consistency is key. Consistency is the backbone of any transformative journey. Continue practicing gratitude, setting intentions, and aligning your actions with your values. 
Even on challenging days, staying consistent with your chosen rituals and practices will yield long-term benefits. 2. Embrace resilience. Life is full of ups and downs, and setbacks are a natural part of any journey. Embrace resilience as your ally. When faced with obstacles, view them as opportunities for growth and learning. Your ability to bounce back from adversity will strengthen your path towards a blessed life. 3. Seek support. You don't have to walk this path alone. Seek support from friends, family, or a mentor who understands your journey and can provide guidance and encouragement. Sharing your challenges and successes with others can be incredibly motivating. 4. Review and adjust. Periodically review your goals, intentions, and daily rituals. As you grow and evolve, your aspirations may change. Be open to adjusting your path to align with your current values and desires. 5. Celebrate milestones. Celebrate your achievements, no matter how small they may seem. Acknowledging your progress reinforces the positive changes you've made and provides motivation to continue. 6. Self-compassion. Be kind to yourself along the way. Remember that it's okay to have setbacks or moments of doubt. Treat yourself with the same compassion and understanding that you extend to others. 7. Reflect on your journey. Take time to reflect on how far you've come. Journaling can be a valuable tool for recording your thoughts, feelings, and insights throughout your journey. It can also help you identify patterns and areas for growth. 8. Stay inspired. Surround yourself with sources of inspiration, whether through books, podcasts, or inspirational figures. These can reignite your passion and enthusiasm for your blessed life journey. A word of encouragement. To those who are striving to change their lives and live a more blessed life, know that every step you take is a step in the right direction. Change is a process, and it often requires time, effort, and patience. There may be moments when you doubt your progress, but remember that transformation takes time and the journey itself is an achievement. Stay committed to your vision and continue nurturing the positive changes you've initiated. Even in the face of challenges, stay resilient and know that each obstacle is an opportunity for personal growth. Your journey towards a more blessed life is worth every effort, and the blessings you cultivate along the way will be a testament to your dedication. In the words of Winston Churchill, the success is not final, failure is not fatal, it is the courage to continue that counts. Keep moving forward with courage and determination, and your path to a more blessed life will lead you to a place of fulfillment and contentment that you've always dreamed of. In closing, I want to emphasize that the journey to a blessed life is not a destination but a continuous adventure filled with discovery, growth, and fulfillment. Throughout this book, we've explored the various aspects that contribute to living a life infused with gratitude, happiness, meaningful relationships, abundance, purpose, resilience, balance, and spirituality. As you reflect on the chapters you've journeyed through, remember that your life is a canvas and you hold the brush. Every day is an opportunity to paint a new stroke, add vibrant colors, and create a masterpiece of your own blessed life. Embrace gratitude, for it has the power to transform the ordinary into the extraordinary. Cultivate inner happiness, nurture your relationships, and welcome abundance into your existence. Discover your purpose and meet life's challenges with unwavering resilience. Find balance, prioritize your well-being, and explore the depths of your faith and spirituality. As you embark on this lifelong quest, know that you are never alone. The universe conspires in your favor, and there's a higher power guiding your steps. Surround yourself with positivity, seek the support of loved ones, and draw strength from your inner reserves. Create your blessed life plan, set clear intentions, and commit to daily rituals that align with your vision. Remember, it's the small, consistent actions that lead to profound transformation over time. Your blessed life is not a destination you reach someday, it's a path you walk every day. Each moment is an opportunity to choose gratitude, love, and purpose. Your life is a testament to the beauty that emerges when you live in alignment with your values and beliefs. Believe in yourself, for you have the power to create the life you desire. Embrace every challenge as a stepping stone to your dreams and let setbacks be the fuel for your growth. This is your life, your story, and your legacy. May your days be filled with joy, your heart with love, and your spirit with an unwavering sense of purpose. You are capable of living a truly blessed life, and I have full confidence that you will. Thank you for taking this journey with me. Here's to a life overflowing with blessings, fulfillment, and boundless happiness. You are deserving of every wonderful thing that comes your way.